my goodness. Okay, guys, so um, I am mostly set up in this new place. Um, I have very temporary places for things like the gym. <laughs> uh, so this is the first room of the house. So I have no idea what this room was previously used for, but now going to be my temporary ghetto gym. But I mean, I've got some pretty cool stuff. I will put some flooring down. I'm gonna get a bench. Uh, and a barbell and I will be able to do most things and a lot of the stuff that I use like for accessories I will probably hang along this wall here and then of course a gym wouldn't be a gym without my flag <laughs> so this weekend I have got like a thousand things that I want to hang up so um, I'm gonna be busy being a builder or a laborer this weekend so I'm looking forward to that, but this is the gym. Uh, I know at some point I would love to film for you guys like all of the things that I would recommend if you want to have a home gym set up that allows you to best train your entire body, but on the fewest items possible, which I know is uh, really important for a lot of you guys, particularly those people that are super busy, you don't have time to get out to the gym. That was the whole reason why I wanted to have a home gym because I didn't want to drive 20 minutes there. 20 minute back because that was my time and time costs you money. So yeah, look forward to that. I'm gonna come around and we'll have a look at the rest of the place. Alrighty, so we have a really random bathroom in here. Go, go and stick your head in there. It is the strangest concept ever, but I didn't buy this place because I don't have taste. It's because I have an imagination, so. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that space, but I'm probably gonna knock out some walls in here and make that like one big room and build in a more functional um, like bathroom. It could be a guest room or something like that. Eventually I won't have the gym equipment in here. Um, this is kind of my part-time place. <laughs> so, but here's where all the good stuff is at. It's so light and bright here. Um, I feel like this kitchen has more bench space than my regular house, the one that is still for sale, which I'm still trying to sell. So I had to uh, scrounge together some funds to, to pay for this bad boy, but I'm so happy with it. Um, like, look at all the bench space. <laughs> it just keeps going. <laughs> so plenty of space to do some cooking. I think I'm gonna film some stuff for you guys later today. Um, I got a really funky light when I moved in. This is not mine, but that's what was here. So I guess it'll do for now. <laughs> but all my stuff fits good. We had a little accident uh, a little while ago with this giant mirror. So I have to get this. Yeah, that was a mess to clean up. <laughs> it's like shattered. Um, and then all the stuff here that's leaning up against the wall is um, the pool table. So when you um, travel with a really large pool table, uh, I guess they kind of have to dismantle it and then take the felt off the top to get into the screws. So um, I'm kind of happy that that happened because it needed to be refelted anyway. And I want to weatherproof the whole thing. Now it's apart and in pieces. Whoever is going to do that will have a lot easier time like accessing the whole table. So. Yeah, um, I don't know where I'm, what I'm gonna do with this little space yet, but um, it's, it's hanging out there for now. Living area, but then most importantly, the best view in the whole house is this amazing opening sliding video. So this is gonna be, well actually it's very sunny right now, I need my sunglasses on, but. Um, I love it. I am such a, an outdoor person. Like if I could bring the outdoors in, like I will. Um, I always joke and said if I ever built a gym, it's gonna be like completely glass so that I can still be outside, but like UV protected. <laughs> so lots of light, very white. This is my office. Oops, let me pull that up. I don't know that I've used this yet. It works. It too has one of these massive big windows that opens up if I want to get some fresh air whilst I'm working. Um, so yeah, this is where my little office and hangout will be. I've got all my cat posts. 
The walls are still looking a little barren um, and I just need to get something homely in here, but it is has a lot of potential. I don't know about this random light fixture. <laughs> Oh, there's some really quirky things that have been left in this house and they didn't have the internet um, like a telephone jack either which is like how did you did you use the internet so um, I have had to organize um, quite a few things uh, for installation um, there's another bathroom back there we don't have to worry about that it's my cat's bathroom right now uh, and then some storage and the patio so this is definitely routinely where I will come and sit to do some social media posts it's so pretty out here um, but lately I've hardly had any time to use this space until like late in the evening uh, because I've been chained to my computer desk. I've just had so much like administrative stuff to organize. You guys know that I just started a new company and we had like six weeks to basically hire a team, like the whole team. Well, I had to interview everybody. <laughs> so it was uh, a mad rush and also trying to buy a house, sell a house, get divorced, all those good things. <laughs> Sorry, uh, a lot of sleepless nights, but I'm so happy that uh, I made it through because if I can get through that, I know I can get through anything. Um, but uh, yeah, I I love this space. I have already got myself all the little fairy lights. I bought some bright pink flowers. Like, you know those Spanish looking flowers that you see on the wall, like, I don't know, in, in Greece, and it's just beautiful and hot pink. So I think I'm gonna do something girly now because it's just me. <laughs> so I'm gonna do like planter boxes and vine all the way over the back wall. Probably get like a fun neon light and like just a place that feels really homely. And I just love it. And I've got a couple of friends coming to visit, uh, I think next week. And yeah, there's been a lot of back and forth between Tampa and Fort Lauderdale but so good. Let's go have a look in the master bedroom. It's pretty big. <laughs> okay. So for a small, well, for a condo, which is what this is, I feel like this bedroom has a lot of size. Don't mind the fact that my bed doesn't have a cover on it. I just changed the bed over. But um, yeah, this is my space and it has the beautiful big windows and doors as well. I'm gonna knock all of this out when I do the renovation so that it's again, like I want the outside inside. <laughs> so it's just gonna be floor to ceiling windows all the way around um, with, oh, oh, I've got the energy left, you get the point. <laughs> it opens. <laughs> so yeah, this is gonna be my space. Peloton. I think I've used this once in the last week because I couldn't didn't have any time to leave. So um, yeah, this is the space. Um, I'm sure we'll probably do a whole lot more filming here soon. So. Yeah.